my boo thing or whatever. I know you guys were waiting for that. I know you guys were waiting for me to say something about that. I know you guys were like, oh my god, when is she gonna talk about her boyfriend? Oh my god. What's good, guys? I'm finally back. My sit down videos, cheese me on the with you guys, all of that stuff. I missed all of this so much. I just miss sitting down, getting ready, looking like a badass bitch. Because, duh, because, period, because, duh. For today's video, I'm just gonna be doing a get ready with me. I'm just gonna be cheesing me on with you guys, catching up on all the tea. Just finally being able to sit down and actually cheese me out. Because what's better than andar cheese me on with you guys than andar cheese me con otra gente envidiosa? I mean, I'm pretty sure there's like some videos I was literally watching this right now, like con la baba pa fuera, but it's okay because we could cheese me out with them too. Actually, fuck it, we're cheese me out with everybody. But anyways, yeah, we're just gonna be getting ready today, so whoever's watching this literally right now and is hearing me speak, get up, stop laying down, stop being on your phone, stop scrolling on TikTok, YouTube, Instagram, whatever you're on, get up, girl, get ready, or boy, whatever, get ready with me because let's just feel good about ourselves, let's just feel like bad bitties, even though we're beautiful naturally, but no le duele a nadie to get ready, hacer tu maquillaje, it doesn't hurt nobody to actually get up and get ready and do your makeup, so what we gonna do my calentón is on and it makes heck of noise i'm super sorry if you guys are like annoyed okay so lately i've been doing my makeup a bit different i've been just changing it up a little like not like oh my god like anyway but i'm just like kind of like learning well not learning but i'm just like doing my makeup i guess a bit more different than how i usually do because i feel like i would do my eyebrows too like thick and dark and i don't really want to do my brows like that anymore i kind of want to do a more natural brow look so i started off with just concealing my brows first if you guys are wondering what concealer i use i use the becca one i totally do not recommend this concealer um but i do use it to conceal so i recommend it for concealing like your brows and stuff but i don't recommend it to put it like under your eyes or anything because this shit is like not cool it's like ugly like it makes your skin look like patchy or maybe it's just me because my circles are hella bad, but no, I don't like it. So I did my cameras off camera. Wait. So, so I did my eyebrows off camera because... I feel like it just takes too much time and it's pretty self-explanatory if you guys want to update it brow routine brow root i just can't talk i'm very like anyways if you guys want to update a brow routine let me know because i got you guys with that i know this one looks more filled in than this one but i don't know what it looks like honestly it does huh but i barely put any product on them like i'm trying not to use my pomade anymore so i just use the access that's on the brush you know Razzle dazzle. Okay, but dead ass. I know everyone says this about this thing. Like a tech of famous on TikTok, the elf poreless putty primer. Oh my god, bruh. I kid you guys not. This shit is like the bomb. No, like I feel like you guys have to buy it. Like if you don't buy it, like I feel like your makeup is not gonna be complete until you buy it. Just buy it and then like let me know what you guys think, okay? <laughs> Anyways, I feel like I'm hella talking, but it's like I'm ready with me for a reason, you know? But I cheese mad and like just be annoying. So, um, I was just gonna tell you guys that. Okay, so I use the Fit Me Maybelline foundation. This one, right? Wait, do I use 230? Or. So, this one is the one that I use. I use this one in the shade 230, but I feel like it's a little too light on me. Like, I asked my cousins if it looks light on me, and they said no, but I feel like it does. Like, I don't know, I feel like it sometimes does, but then it doesn't. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna just put like a shade darker. And it kind of even looks, this one looks kind of wider though. Fuck, like, I don't know if it's gonna match me or not. But I got another one in the shade 310, sun beige. So I'm gonna try this one on, and hopefully my makeup does not look fucked up. Because if it does, like, I'm gonna cry because, like, I literally am gonna waste. We're well, not gonna waste it, but like I'm gonna waste my time doing my makeup for it just to come out ugly, you know? If you guys think that I put a lot, I do because I put on makeup to look different, right? And low key, I feel like these products make me break out. But then again, I don't know. 
maybe because when I wash my face, oh no, not wash my face, but maybe because when I have it on, I wash my face hella late, like hasta la noche, and I keep it on for like a long time. And there was one time where I just took off my makeup and I didn't fucking wash my face, like I just took it off with the, what do you call it? With the freaking makeup wipe. Ugh, I can't talk, guys, sorry. So far, I feel like it's good, no? Cuantos tragos me olvido de ella. Do you guys remember that song? The Atrás del Vaso? Bruh, that song, I would hella play in Mexico. I think I need to wear my beauty blender again because this shit is like drying. Dude, I low key think that this is my shade. Oh, yes, dude. You guys know. Oh my god, I'm already out of breath. And this is the thing that I hate about gaining weight is that I run out of breath easily again. Well, I feel like I've always been like this, to be honest. Even cuando estaba flacucha or whatever. Like, todavía I couldn't even breathe. I don't even know what I have to cheese me out, to be honest. My life is super boring. Like, I don't do any... I know I'm supposed to be looking at the camera, but like, you know how when you get ready, you look at yourself? And that's me right now, so... I'm not looking at the camera, but I'm talking to you guys, okay? So, like, no se me sientan dolidos. But, yeah, like I was saying, my life is super boring. Like, I literally don't have friends, guys. I don't go out like with friends because how am I going to go out with friends if I don't have any? Um, I don't even go out to be honest. The only thing I do is like hang out with the laundry, go to Target. That's like my fun things to do now. Antes it was go to my friend's house, be done, <laughs> have fun. And yeah, now it's not like that. I'm just, I'm just staying home, you know. This whole pandemic thing is just getting more serious. So I've been staying home more, just doing me, chilling. I'm gonna try and focus more on YouTube, focus more on myself, not really be like worried about other things besides myself first, of course, my family, my YouTube, my boo thing or whatever. I know you guys were waiting for that. I know you guys were waiting for me to say something about that. I know you guys were like, oh my god, when is she gonna talk about her boyfriend? Oh my god. Um, a lot of you guys have been telling me like, oh, why don't you bring him on the channel? Like, this, this, and that. I don't think that I would bring him on here. Just because, like, he's very shy. And I feel like he would never want to do YouTube. Like, in general. Because he's super shy, to be honest. But then again, he's super chill. Like, he's super cool. I feel like it would be so cool to do YouTube with him in the future, you know? But only God knows. So... I don't know, but for now, like, I'm not gonna post him, like, you know, or nothing like that. Obviously, until he meets my parents as well, too. And just to clarify, we're not, like, dating. Well, we're talking, I guess. We're basically, like, together. It doesn't even matter. Like, I feel like labels don't matter as long as both of us know what's up, then, you know? I just say my boyfriend because, like, that's literally me. But, um, like, obviously, when I explained it to my mom and stuff, I said that we were talking because I feel like that's more, like... That's how I should have, ex that's how I should explain, that's how I had to explain it to her. Because I feel like a novio for like Mexican parents or at least my Mexican family is like, oh my god, novio, like, yes, van a casar, van a tener bebés. Like, I feel like dating novios like that. But talking, I feel like I explained to her and she kind of understood. I don't really want to talk about how my mom reacted, but um, all I'm going to say is my mom knows that we're talking. I kind of told my dad about it, but not like really. Like, I don't know how to explain it, like. He saw the back of my phone, because on the back of my phone I have a picture of us, of the day of my quinceañera. It's like a Polaroid. It's not a recent picture, guys. Like, it's from my quinceañera. It's literally about to be a year ago. So, yeah, that picture was from my quinceañera, and it's on the back of my phone, obviously, on the Polaroid. And my dad saw it, and he was like, I always say yes to yes to no, and he was just talking to me. But, like, it wasn't, like, a serious conversation where I straight up told him what's up with me and my boyfriend and stuff like that. So I need to do that soon. But anyways, yeah, that's my little relationship status or whatever. How it's been going on. Um, personally, me, I've just been doing good on my own. Like, like me-wise, no relationship-wise, not nothing else besides me. Um, 
I feel like I'm doing very good. I'm in a good place right now, like my head. It's just I have my days where I just don't know what I'm doing. I'm, there's just days where I get really confused, but I don't want to say that I'm doing bad or that I'm sad. or No, I don't want to think like that. So I just say, I'm still good, you know. I'm, I feel like I'm good. I just have my days where I'm just like, oh, like I don't know what to do. Like I just get very stressed out because I feel like I stress myself out way too much, honestly. Um, excuse me, this concealer looks so freaking white. I feel like i'm good i just have my days you know it's just i feel like i'm having a very confused like spot right now like with myself and with youtube and everything it's just kind of hard you know like keeping up and always posting and always like being active on social media like i feel like it's easy but then it is hard sometimes when you don't really know what you're doing and i feel like lately i've been super lazy and that's why i've been feeling like that because i don't get nothing done i don't film i don't take pictures anymore i don't do tiktoks and that's what i'm supposed to do like this is literally my job i can't be lazy i can't be doing that no like i literally have to get my ass up and cut the slack bro i'm literally so fucking bad I did my like contour and shit wrong. I tried to contour for the first fucking time and I look like an idiot. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. Literally, what the fuck is this? How do you guys do this shit, bro? I'm so mad. Oh my god, I'm furious. Honestly, the only reason why I'm getting ready is because I want to make TikToks like of me looking good i'm gonna try and go to sleep at like 12. that's pretty early for me because i usually sleep like at five in the morning but today was the first day of school like back to school since winter break and like i told myself i made myself a promise that i'm gonna actually wake up for school and join all my classes and everything because i just don't want to be slacking anymore like fuck that i want to actually like do good in my classes and not be stressing over grades not this this is not nah, i just want to just finished school already bro i just can't wait for summer i hate school so much like i just can't i'm so mad because i feel like my makeup's coming out ugly like ugh. We're well, we're well, we're well. meanwhile i'm gonna decide what lashes i should wear okay so i'm gonna for sure just bronze i need to get a new bronzer that's what i need today i went to freaking ulta i got like four things i spent like 70 something bro like mm -mm. I know you guys are like, that's not even a lot. No, that's that's something, bro. Well, that's something. Like, what? Especially since, like, now I pay for all my things. Like, I literally pay for everything. Like, in California, I'm gonna compro a freaking bottle of water. I buy it, you know? So it's like, now me duele. The money that I spend me duele, dude. So now I understand how my parents felt when they have to buy me so many things throughout my entire childhood. For sure, so I understand them now. This is the Jacqueline Hope palette. I've literally had it. For like years like i don't know how long i've had it for but just know i've had it for super long alonjo got it for me like when i was in my little phase of wanting to do makeup but i never even did an eye look ever in my life like i've actually never tried to do an eye look the only thing i do is use these two natural colors right here i go boop 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 and then i go and i just put on my freaking lid i don't even know what i'm doing like i just do it you can't even see bro look you can't even see what I'm doing. So I literally ended up not doing my makeup anymore. I took it off. I didn't even end up <laughs> finishing my lips or anything or even putting on any lashes. I felt so ugly that I literally just took it off. And I didn't even film an outro. So I'm super sorry, you guys. But yeah, that is the end of today's video. Really hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And remember to always stay positive because we do not need no negativity up in this B-I-T-C-H. Period. As we should. Duh. Period. Cause duh. Cause yes. And also remember to always stay blessed and never stress.